Hello everyone, welcome back again to Mufasu Cat channel with AutoCAD Dynamic Block Basic Cut Tutorial How to use a stretch action with a linear parameter For example, in here I will create a rectangle object and we can give a dimension for this rectangle 30 next 70 Okay, we can apply hatch into this uh, object, you can tap hatch enter and select cut this area Okay, I will use uh, this uh, ANSI 31 and change scale into 5. You can close hatch creation. Okay, in here uh, I will uh, convert uh, this object into block. Uh, you can tap a block, enter. For name, I will give uh, it a sample. For pick point, you can click at uh, this point. And for select object, you can select uh, this all object, enter and click OK to apply. To edit uh, this block, you can double click and then you can click OK to go to block editor. Okay, in block editor, we can insert a linear parameters. You can click in here parameter step and click a linear. I will uh, uh, click at uh, this point, okay, in the middle and move uh, to this point in the middle and you can uh, move uh, to the dragger. Okay, now we can uh, attach. Uh, stretch uh, action into these parameters you can click action tab and click stretch select uh, this parameter for point i will click at this point and for stretch frame you can create in here okay for stretch frame next you can select the object select in here click enter to apply okay we also can uh, attach a stretch action in uh, this point you can click stretch and select uh, this uh, parameter Next, you can select at this point. Okay, for uh, stretch frame, we create uh, in here. And next, for object, you can select at this object. Enter to apply. Okay, to view this block, you can click in here, touch block, and select at this block. Okay, you can see we have uh, this uh, two mark. If you click at this point, you can move uh, to the top here. It will be stretch. Okay, or you can click at this point. To move to the bottom here okay we also can create a stretch action into x-axis okay you can close a text block and we create again uh, with uh, linear uh, parameters i will click uh, from middle point in here to here and move uh, to the bottom and i will uh, apply a stretch action you can select uh, this parameter click at this point and for stretch frame, we create in here. Okay. Next for object, we select uh, these two objects and enter. You can test block in here. And we, if we select this block, you can click at uh, this mark. We can stretch into x axis in here. Okay. Or you can stretch again into a y axis. Okay. We also can uh, set up. Uh, with increment uh, for x axis, okay. You can select uh, this uh, parameter and next uh, for uh, value sheet in here. Uh, for example, I will use increment and for distance increment in here, I will set into uh, 40. Okay, you can see this uh, with uh, 40 for increment and you can test block in here. Okay, if we select uh, this object and you can click at uh, this uh, point, we can uh, uh, extend this object with uh, increment like uh, to 70 into 110 into 150. This will be increment in uh, 40 points. Okay, for uh, this uh, extent, all is available. You can close a text block and close a block editor save change and next uh, we can use uh, this uh, block into uh, your drawing okay enough today for autocad dynamic block basic uh, tutorial how to use a stretch action with a linear parameter if you have any question about this uh, tutorial you can comment below this video and see you next time in another autocad dynamic block basic tutorial